Bruce Wayne here, Gotham Collections. Quick little video here for you. It's a picture of a door. What could be behind the door? Well, I don't know. Nobody knows what's behind this door, so we better check and find out. It's a, it's a small little room. One could say it's a closet. Couldn't possibly have anything inciting in here, could there be? Let's take a look. Let's get with the door here. All right. Oh, oh let's turn on the light. Oh. Oh my God, it is. It is Brucey Wayne's man closet. Oh my God. All right. Look, look. Now, I wanted to show you this room mainly because I'm very proud of it, but not for the stuff that's in it, just for the amount of crap I was able to fit in such a tiny little room. Like, you know, here's my foot. So not a whole lot of room here. We got one, two, three feet wide. That's crazy. Um, so yes, lo so much stuff here. I could barely fit through it. Um, comic books are down below. Uh, none of my PC books are in here. They're just uh, minor to medium keys and runs. Uh, so there's no poop at all. I got rid of all the poop. Every single poop I had, it went to a store and traded. So it's gone now. So I'm very proud of that too. But the amount of crap I was able to fit in here, I think, I think is quite astonishing. So let's take a quick look and see what kind of crap I have here. And um, hmm, there you go. So this is pretty cool. Pretty proud of this here. This is this is a, um, a very large photo of uh, Batman and Robin. I uh, can't see the back of it there, but and it's uh, it comes with a certificate from PSA. You can't get really better than PSA, and it's signed by Bert Ward, Robin, and Adam West, Batman. So that's pretty cool. This was actually in one of those Treasury Edition sports things where you buy a box of crap and you don't know what's inside and you find all these little relics. Uh, so the store owner got the Batman relic in here and uh, he knew I would want it. So uh, basically I, uh, I, you know, I paid for it and uh, he was happy. He got some of his money back and uh, he made his customer happy too. So there you go. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. So, and I framed that. Uh, I had to frame that myself, but still pretty nice. All right. So we got Bat Batman Beyond there. McDonald's or Burger King toy there. Hundredth edition Batman. We have a cool little Joker cycle. Oh boy. Darwin Cook. Figure there is one of my personal favorite uh, dolls that I have. Harley Quinn still in the box, of course. Beautiful, beautiful. Nice little toys there. Here we are. Mm -hmm. This is a nice little carousel thing I got from biscuit it weighs about 500 pounds and it really doesn't hold comics very nicely it's kind of like comics and then on this side is magazines kind of thing so the different sizes so it kind of fucks things up but it works well for me i guess not too bad uh, nothing too crazy in here and pretty nice book so obviously that one's nice that's just a facsimile some of my favorite colors i like the covers that i like to uh, look at so um, these are some of my favorites just you know to, just to make just to look at so we'll be on this side we have some of the you know minor to me medium keys so I like to flip them open whenever there's a hot book coming that I just found out about on the the internet or the, the key collector app or something and it it's really a pain in the ass. There's comics behind here and, and every time I have to go look oh this book's hard I have to go look and it literally takes me about half an hour to remove that crap out of here and then go through the comics and pray to God I know where it is to begin with and then put this crap back. So it takes, it is quite, uh, it's, it's starting to hurt the back too, uh, honest, honestly. But uh, whatever, it's, what what can you do? So so there we have a cool little Batman Batmobile there with some, some nice box there. It's an old Archie. Pretty nice little drawing from here given to me as a gift uh, many years ago. Pretty neat. Uh, we have some old Batman records. We have two actually. But whatever, yep. Yeah, pretty exciting. This is a, a print, a Bob Kane print, and it's all signed by Bob Kane for certificate, so that's pretty cool. Uh, this is a very cool uh, 1960s Life magazine, Adam West Batman. Beautiful. Oh, yes, we have some toys here. Toys. 
to the Batmobile. This is really cool. Uh, this is actually quite large. It was a, bat a McDonald's display back in the animated toys uh, back in the day. So it has all the toys there, and it's the actual display that was in the McDonald's store in Australia, actually. So this is the only page I have from a, a Batman-related book, and this is an issue of Robin. Uh, some of my, you know... Some of my CGCs, nothing too crazy. Uh, we have some newsstands, both newsstands, which are extremely hard to find. And I keep telling everyone, get the newsstand first appearance of Domino. So anyway, I was able to get those two. We got some Gabby's in the back, 9.8s, and some Wolverine, some local art, beautiful. So some cool statues here. This is this thing actually works. It should shine the bat thing on the on the, on the wall, so that's cool. That is the greatest toy ever created. It is Goose. Everybody loves Goose. I highly recommend you find this toy right away. That's pretty cool. There's a very valuable college pale kids. Um, there's a first Wolverine in Lego. <laughs> Got some cool Transformers Jetfire. Some cool statues of Rocket Richard signed and uncertified card. Mario Demuse certified autographs. Oh, beautiful. This was at a convention in San Diego, I believe, and the creators of this toy all signed the box. So inside there was a mystery bo uh, toy, a uh, Bat Batman figure, so that's pretty cool. I don't know why this thing's worth a fortune. And then these little toys here, pretty cool too. Uh, yeah, there we go. Still in the box, the Batmobile, beautiful. Toy Story, original, excellent, yes, beautiful. So, there we go. That's a Collected plate here, some toys. That's really cool. This uh, NASCAR. Uh, it was an actual NASCAR Batman on it. So that's a super rare Deadpool toy. And then we have the uh, Blackbird in the behind there. So pretty cool. So that's uh, that's pretty much everything. Uh, I do have a large toy uh, Batman toy collection. I've over twenty five large uh, rubber made containers, all filled with Batman toys, plus what you see here. So I got a lot of that crap. So. But uh, nowhere to display it, uh, so it's all in storage. And the PC collection that's in storage, uh, the military compound uh, with eight uh, guards and some uh, nuclear weapons and shit. So nobody's getting into that one. So, but anyway, um, I hope you enjoyed the Bruce C. Wayne uh, man cave. So have a good one, everyone. Bye bye.